Hey everyone, I'm Mega G Wolf and welcome back to Sonic Superstars. Today we're going into Press Factory, which um, I actually like the stage. I, I like Act One more than I like Act Two because I think Act Two's gimmick reminds me too much of uh, other gimmicks from stages I'm not really a big fan of. Um, but this one, after a timer, will uh, will knock you up. Um, yeah, you saw Knuckles climbing there. I didn't actually... I don't remember seeing that, so that's kind of new for me. But, uh, there's a lot of warning about when it's going to happen. Because you can see the big press in the background actually raise up and, and slam down, and that's when it hits. But there's also little timers dotted around the actual map itself that you can follow along to. Okay. <laughs> and, uh, I like that. I really do like that. I think that's one of the things that I'll, uh praise about this stage a lot of the time is that it does have a lot of like visualization of, of the gimmick <laughs> uh, and i don't actually remember where any of the rings are in this one like the special stage rings i usually find them by mistake okay i guess i'm waiting boing <laughs> so yeah you can actually see eh. oh okay sure you fired just as i was about to hit you you cheeky little What's over this way? Oh. Oh, is this is it goodies? No, it's a medal. Of course, they wouldn't want to give you too much of a hint on where to go if it was a special stage ring, I suppose. Eh, there we go. We'll try going up this way and see if we can find anything up here. I think, if I recall, I have more luck. <laughs> I'm really getting hit today. I have more luck finding special stage rings on uh, the second act. Hmm, I want to be up. I don't know why. I'm. That guy looked like he jumped over my my attack. That was pretty great. Uh, anything up here? Nope. It's just normal. Ooh, goodness. Oh, oh did I hear it? Oh yeah, it's below me. How do I go down there? Ah, no. I need to see if I can get down below me. So, oh, oh yeah, there we go. Uh, uh, what can I, oh, actually I got a refresh, didn't I? No! <laughs> there we go. Wait, what? Oh, it's down, it's even further down, oh. Oh, oh, okay. Ah, uh, why didn't that work? Uh, yeah, okay. What else have we got? We've got, uh, this. There you go. Modern day problems require modern day solutions. And this is the last emerald, I think, right? That's exciting. Oh, God. Oh, no. exciting but i feel like i'm i'm gonna panic a bit if i ugh, things don't go my way Woo! oh my goodness boing now i want to go in that yeah nice wow i think that's like one of the earlier times i've gotten all the emeralds I actually really like what the last emerald offers in terms of power, right? Because it's extra. And you might think like, okay, what does that do? <laughs> it, it's a little extra. Um, but it actually gives these characters their more unique powers. So for example, uh, Sonic actually gets the homing attack. <laughs> and you kind of expect what the other characters will get. Uh, Amy can like throw hammers and, and Knuckles I think can like punch and Tails can like shoot a little like tail slice effect I think I don't actually remember I did I did use them but I don't I don't remember all the all the details and now more importantly we have this <laughs> let's go and it actually gets to play one of my favorite well, one of my favorite. It is definitely up there now as one of my favorite uh, Supersonic themes. I 
I also like the difference. And this is something that I've spoken about before. The difference in themes in this case for Super in this one versus something like Mania. Like Mania's Super theme is very like powerful feeling, right? Because it's just like, oh my God, this is a powerhouse of, of just energy and he's going to fucking destroy everything. Whereas in this one, it's more like, like adventurous and like, yeah, supersonic. Woo! <laughs> and I, I like the differences between them. And I, I like both of the themes. And as you can see, it detransforms us in a boss fight, which uh, we can just turn back on again. <laughs> it's a little annoying it does that, but. Now that we have Super Sonic, certain boss fights are going to be a cakewalk. Monkey. Uh. Sonic 1 called, they want their final boss back. <laughs> we can't use any of the other abilities while we're Super Sonic, by the way. I forget, can you untransform? Oh, you can untransform. I don't know why you'd want to necessarily, but you can do that. I mean, maybe to save your rings, I guess. Or if you know that there's like a section where it's like an auto scroller. Actually, that's true. <laughs> I'm already thinking of one area where I'd want to do that. Eh, damn it. I missed. Do I missed. Nice. Uh, I'll just go to act two. If I was playing on my main save, then I'd worry about the medals, but I'm not. This is a save file purely for this. It exploded. Okay, act two. This is where things get a little annoying. <laughs> Look, here's our little robot. There's a little robot friend in the back there. I wonder what he does. Hmm, looks like a meter that's filling up. And a button to uh, get rid of that. Yep, every single time, I swear this gimmick. I hate it. <laughs> I hate being put on a timer. Ugh, it annoys me. It stresses me out. Every single time without fail, by the way. I also don't know if Supersonic actually protects you against what happens when it fills up. Because I'm pretty sure it's just an insta-kill. Um, so I don't actually think that... Ugh. Nope. Also, these orbs are different from what you expect. They're not like the ones from the Sonic & Knuckles special stages. These actually require you to just press in the direction in which you want to go and then hit jump and you'll go that way. It's very weird. I, I don't like it because it feels so against what I'm used to. Ooh. Okay. Uh, uh, this way. Bhutan. Thankfully, there are a lot of buttons. <laughs> like a lot. So keeping, keeping up to date with keeping that thing off is not too bad. Oh, it's these things. Huh. I didn't actually notice that. Ah! <laughs> well, then. Was not expecting that. Sudden demise. We've also got these, like, exploding platform things. They take just a little bit of time to get going. Just enough to delay you, right? To panic you a bit before the next button press. It's almost like they're doing it on purpose. <laughs> no. They wouldn't. Oh, God. Okay. Dang. There goes all my rings. I was saving up for the supersonic transformation. Then again, I don't know if I'm, you know, too worried about using it. Since it is, it makes everything kind of like a breeze. Kind of. There are some situations in which it doesn't. And away! Nice. 
Yeah, unfortunately, that wasn't where the gimmick ended. Oh, I, why use this? Oh, just to get the medals. It really does just recommend you to do things just to get medals sometimes. Oh, that was cheeky. I could have died to that. Oh, okay. Oh, what? I swear that the hitbox on those things is weird. Lost all my rings. Could have gone super. But I didn't even think about it. Oh, no! Never mind. <laughs> oh, I didn't actually know that they just hurt you. If you run into the spikier bits. Apparently so. Oh, those guys have little spikes that comes out of them. I was wondering what the snails like even did. Like what's their <laughs> what's their danger? They're just kinda on there. They have little spikes that come out of them. Oh my god, I hate these things. Why are they the bane of my existence? Also, this bit takes too long. Okay! Okay! I guess I'll take it the long way! Alright, <laughs> stupid spear, sphere things. God damn. <laughs> you'll take your sweet time and you'll like it. Okay. 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 I'm back down here again. Okay. Everything's against me. Remember when I said I didn't like the stage as much as the first one? Yeah. There's a lot of reasons why. <laughs> oh, can I not do it on here? I guess not. Well, that was a uh, not very useful thing. Jeez. Uh, okay, I'm good. Down I go. Wee. So unnecessary. Last button press. Okay. God, everything's hurting me. I don't like it. <laughs> Yay. And then we just fall for an uncomfortable amount of time <laughs> with nothing going on. Some rings at least. Yay. I think it's the end of the stage now. I'm falling. And there we go. Now we have the uh, previous stage as a boss gimmick. The old thumper. He's like, I like the idea of this. <laughs> this boss, I remember having a bit of trouble with. I don't think the first time I fought him, but like in general, I do have a little bit of trouble with him because there's a lot of opportunities to get uh, crushed. And that that is frustrating. Thankfully, the little power here does help. Woo! <laughs> I'm up here! Oh my god, hello! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> I'm bugged. I am constantly spinning. I can't jump. Okay, there we go. Ugh. Ah! Woo! Uh, do I have anything that I can use against? Uh, slow. Okay. <laughs> Give me a moment to think. Jesus. There he is back there. He was very lucky to land on that. And off he goes. But the real question is, where does he go? Ba bum bum. Yeah. Nice! We did it! Oh boy! <laughs> Golden Capital! I love this stage. It's so cool. It's so golden. 
There's lots of rings to be had. I don't actually know too many stages that go for just like the pure gold aesthetic in Sonic. So this is actually kind of nice. I will say that is the one thing I've liked is that while some of the themes are, you know, kind of predictable in some ways, they at least do some interesting things with them to make them stand out from the usual crowd of, let's say, you know, your your volcano level, or your lava level, or like, you know, your ice level, which we haven't got to yet. I'm stuck in an endless loop. Please help. <laughs> help me! <laughs> oh my god, I 69. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, there we go. I want to get in that. There we go. Yeah! You know what? If everything's gonna be golden, so will I. I know it might be a bit cliche, but you can call me Golden Sonic. <laughs> Plus, there's loads of places here to keep your supersonic transformation going. I also noticed that there was a there's a special stage ring up here. Whoop! I didn't actually mean to go in it. Catch the medals. I think this is just stage one's layout. Nice, I did it. Five medals. Now there is a reason in terms of like, even if you're not gonna play the multiplayer, there is a reason why you'd wanna get the medals, kind of. <laughs> if you're like me anyway, uh, and like a little bit of extra like customization in your experience. There is a pretty neat thing you can do with the the medals. Even if you're not going to be playing the multiplayer. Oh my god, where do all the rings come from? Okay, I'm just gonna... Oh wait, can I not leave to the right? Oh, I think I can. There we go. I was worried that I was like stuck there. Oh my god, everything's taking me out of Supersonic right now. Drill! Bow, 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 bow. Like you wanna you wanna go fast and be invincible? No, you can't. You gotta do this gimmick. God damn it. Alright, fine. Woo! My head's spinning! Whoa! <laughs> I I don't know if that was how that was meant to work. I think it was. Whoa! Ah. Oh, dude, I never actually, like, ducked down with Super Sonic. That looked cool. He's, like, ready to fucking go. <laughs> That's so cool. hey -ya! Okay. We'll go on the bottom path, then. I wanted to go up on the top. Not that it matters too much. Oh, right. This is the stage that has the slices in it uh, duh. what animal are they meant to be again or bug the grasshopper or like mantis it might be a mantis actually what with the the front like the claw things eh. busting makes me feel good straight back into supersonic <laughs> might as well i don't actually know okay i don't know of too many scenarios in which i might get crushed in this I think I'm safe to just kind of go at it. <laughs> Guess we'll find out. I might eat those words. Oh, wait, no, go back. I want that. So many rings. Keeps me going super. Give me the rings. It's actually quite a lot, so it's worth getting those. Hang on, we gotta open this one. That one doesn't open when it turns around like the others do. Oh no, neither does this one. Oh no, this one does. It's weird, it's like, <laughs> follows its own rules of gravity. It's like, no. Yeah, this one's normal. Wait, was that also one? Oh, whatever, it doesn't matter. Let's just continue on. <laughs> Wee! Oh no! 
If you're wondering why we detransform that time, it's because Pigu! Give me my rings back! Hiya! Oh boy, here we go! Woo! Rings! Let's go! <laughs> so many rings! 500! Oh my goodness. And there's some more. Can never have too many rings. Nice. All right. <laughs> now comes uh, oh, Act Two. <laughs> oh, wait, no, we could play Act Knuckles. Yeah, we probably should do Act Knuckles. Ah! It's a very important act because it explains something. Or at least it will do when we actually get through it. What up? It's your boy, Knuckles. All right, I can actually test what his... Yeah, he, he like punches. Oh, and he gets a little Hadouken with it too. <laughs> Hadouken! Wait, what? Oh! Going up. Ah! God damn it. Going up. And there we go. <laughs> uh... Okay. I'm glad that that worked in as it meant to. So one of the things that uh, I point out when I played this before was that when you collect all of the emeralds as a character that isn't supersonic, instead of saying like, oh, Knuckles can now become Super Knuckles, it specifically says Knuckles can now use superpowers. Which I think is dumb. <laughs> I think that's stupid. Let let the other people have super forms at this point. Like, come on. I feel like they should at least have that at this point. Like, I know they don't want to do the whole, you know, Super Saiyan forms thing. I get that. <laughs> sure. It's like, whatever. But supersonic changes look and style. Why can't the others? Right? Like, oh, we get a little bit of pink. Oh, boy. Having a little bit more to them, I think, should be fine. Like, whatever at this point. Woo! My goodness, I'm going everywhere. Okay, I guess I'm not going up that way. Ah! I'm so, like, fast at, at climbing. Never mind, it doesn't actually change anything to do with his climbing. <laughs> Wee! Okay, there we go. I was going to say, am I actually going to be able to make that? Did I need to be up here anyway? Or would that maybe the other way might have just looped me back around? Am I going backwards? No, I am going. I'm going forwards. Uh, help! <laughs> help me! <laughs> okay, well, actually, that's cool. I didn't know that was there, so... Another special stage ring to commit to memory that I won't remember. <laughs> this is a heads up. But I've seen it. I don't actually remember going on this path very often because I do not remember all of the, the like the wind turbine things lifting me up. So this might be a road less traveled. I say that. If this is the only road you can travel as Knuckles, then I guess I just didn't do this stage? I don't know. I'm not 100% sure, I'll be honest, because they've done a few patches to this game. I still don't know if they fixed the, the frame rate thing with the spin dash. Last time someone told me, it seemed like they hadn't, so. Unfortunate, I suppose, <laughs> but not the end of the world, but it's just like, dang. Would have liked to have experienced this in as many frames as possible. Not that it makes that much of a difference, I suppose, but 
just one of those things that's kind of nice, you know? Ah! Oh, I don't know what that whole area was for there. Was that trying to like... Wait, hang on. Am I meant to be going? Oh, okay. Whoa! Yeah, I do not remember this very well. It makes me wonder if I've actually done this before or not. Well, it's just the end now, huh? Not even a boss or anything. Weird. Well, actually, come to think of it, I don't think any of the character stages have bosses when I think about it. I'm just, like, actually struggling to think whether I've gone through that or not. Like, I must have. What? No! I have not done this! I... I would remember this! So it turns out I wouldn't remember this because I did actually play it the very first time. Hi! Editing Mega G Wolf here because uh, I, I go on and be baffled about how I feel like I've never played that stage and uh, I did some checking actually. It turns out every other time I've recorded footage for this video, like every playthrough I've done um, with like Tails and Amy and Knuckles, I specifically skip the character levels. So that's why it's very fresh in my mind, or it feels like that this level, that level that didn't exist. <laughs> so yeah, I just go on for the first little bit of this stage here, just being like, I did what happened, because, you know, smooth brain. Um, and, you know, I guess I'm just getting old and my memory isn't as it used to be. But yeah, as, as you can guess, we have no emeralds, which means no abilities for us, no supersonic. We have to go through the stage completely legit and try and catch up with Fang to get our stuff back. It's our stuff. How dare they take our stuff? Forget, do I actually get to um, magnetize these towards me? Yeah, I do. The big suck. Now, I don't actually remember if this overwrites our shield or if we have the shield. Okay, that answers my question. <laughs> we have the shield underneath it, right? So we're able to keep that as long as we had the normal shield kept. But unfortunately, we got hit. So rip. <laughs> Boing. Oh. No. Let me up. <laughs> And I think these go to a certain level depending on how many people are playing. I often forget that this is like the multiplayer game, like how new Super Mario Brothers was, uh, except like way worse as far as I know. <laughs> I haven't actually played it with anyone yet, so. And will I? I don't know. I assume that uh, the steam remote play would okay i assume that the steam remote play would work with this right i haven't actually tried that maybe i should then again maybe i shouldn't because i've heard a lot of people complain that it's not great <laughs> oh my god uh uh Ah! Ah! Sky Chase, this is not. Oh, man. Wow, those loop de loops look very uh, familiar. Am I right? Sonic fan game enthusiasts? <laughs> oh, God. Oh! I'm actually very surprised I made that. I was very expecting to get hit there. Okay. Okay. Uh. What? I don't even know what. Oh, I'm bouncing off of the bubbles. And he, he must have made one, like, as I was hitting him. So, like, that's why I got bounced in a weird way. I assume. Oh, boy. Are we about to... Are we about to rug ride this? Do 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 do
It's from Aladdin, by the way, if you didn't, if you didn't know that. Of course, anyone that does know that instantly knew that and <laughs> what that was from. Because Rug Ride, notorious. I say that, but, you know, going back as an adult, I realized Rug Ride, not actually that bad. What is bad is the level before it. The level before it is absolutely atrocious. Speaking of things that are actually atrocious. Welcome to what I would consider the first boss that actually is like just straight up bad. I hate it. Okay, ow. Not because, not because of that. <laughs> this boss takes a long goddamn time and is is quite annoying and if you fail you have to do the whole thing and it becomes even more obnoxious in a different setting let's just say that because <laughs> then we got to do all this we're gonna go through all this it is nice to see him that he's like upgrading and that's a cool like spectacle wise this is neat i like this in terms of like okay i get it okay okay uh-huh yep mm-hmm like most of this could have been just cut cool all right now we're back and like, oh man, what's that big mech in the background? That's kind of neat. He shoots the laser beam. We could have hit him there, but he, he spawned in a awkward spot. And so he's being a real pain in the ass right now. And then we have to get rid of these. We do it quickly, otherwise he starts shooting us and that's annoying. Maybe it depends on where we're standing. Okay. Yeah, it's where we're standing. Okay, so we'll just go under him. <laughs> and here we do this bit again. He's changing. He's upgrading again. Riveting gameplay. Ugh. I mean, it's a good thing that you don't have supersonic for this fight because you'd have run out halfway through. <laughs> you'd have just run out. It's like the uh, the obnoxious wait to get to the final boss of Sonic 3. I mean, that's kind of like a nice buildup. So it's not really comparable. But uh, yeah. Oh boy, missiles. Still can't hit him. Oh, missiles. There they go. Okay, now he'll come by. I think this is the one that does the, uh, the try. Yeah. Okay. Eh. I'm just going to tank it. <laughs> it's quicker. Okay. He comes in with even more shields. Got him. Yay. We did it. It only took us like over two minutes <laughs> just for this one thing. Fruit. Da 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 da. Nice. Come down here with our emeralds. Stop. Oh my god. They're adorable. And they're also a dragon. Oh boy. A giant robot. I bet this is going to be an awesome boss fight. Oh.
Yeah, we're friends now. We're going to have soft tacos later. <laughs> I love them. They're the best. Whoa, spoilers! Okay. <laughs> Let's go back to the world map. Ooh. Okay, everyone. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. And if you want to see more Sonic videos, two will be linked in the end slate here. Click on one of those to continue watching. Until next time, take care. Say thanks. Bye.